different. It's like if you've got a full circle dial, which all of you do, you know, the, the, there's two different styles, but all of them have a full circle dial. There's a zero somewhere, you know. So what you do is you look, you find, because if you look at this one, it's got three sets of numbers, doesn't it? That's in order to help you find a zero. Okay, so if it's something that I measure, I start to measure from here, from a, you know, then it's, you know, you'll, you'll look at the zero, and, and we'll, it's going to take a little time to get this. We'll have to just practice with it, okay? But basically with these round ones, you can typically find your zero somewhere, okay? If you can't find a zero, um, okay, so in internal rotation of the hip, the range of motion is 25 degrees. It's recorded as zero to 25, even though the goniometer has moved from 90 to 65. You see, I, just, I, I can teach you how to find a zero. But let's say you can't find your zero, so you start at 90 and you move to 65. You do the math. 65, 90 minus 65 is. You said no math. Huh? 